So, now what? You need to find another clock, but the passage won't be easy. There's another corridor that leads to Pinwheel Circus under the graveyard. The graveyard again? I would have told you this sooner, but I was a little... delayed. Stumpy, I'm going to need you to brace your... Right, no arms. Uh, try to land on your stomach, not your head. But yes, the graveyard again. Find the clock. You should know this one. Holy <laughs> is that George? <laughs> not quite. Shadow Freddy is a reflection of the flip side, the same as everyone else here. He's not him so much as the idea of him. And who's the yellow purple moron? That's the reflection of how most everyone saw you. Hey! You always were a spaz, it seems. Oh, wow. We've been wondering where he came from for forever. Ha! This explains so much. As I was trying to say, you need to go to the graveyard to get to Pinwheel Circus. After what just happened, I'm sure no one will want to delay you. That's the nice way of saying everyone thinks you're gonna lead to something getting destroyed again. A giant snowman wasn't my fault. There you are! We were starting to try and figure out if all of you had fallen into a hole somewhere. <laughs> we're here. We have directions. Who's ready to go back to the graveyard again? What? No. What? To get to Pinwheel Circus. It's the fastest route. Well, nobody there probably wants to talk to us right now, so at least it'll be fast. There's another glitch just over the hill that you can use to get there. It should take you no time at all. And speaking of glitches, I have my own business to deal with. I'll see all of you later. Come on, big guy. Bet I can beat you over the hill. I've got a longer stride. We'll see. Hey, Foxy. Yes? Weird question, but I know there's like 15 different Bonnies and Foxies and Freddies running around, but how did you know somebody's... Who you, but not you, like Mango. You just do. You try to ignore it and not think about the fact that you're the only one that happened to, and that nobody has any good explanations for now, or why, or why one else is perfectly fine. You just deal with it, quietly, internally. Please don't tell me there's two of you now, I might scream. Now I was just wondering. Thanks. Shortly. Well, here we are again. This time, let's try not to get into any fights. You don't have to tell me twice. Don't tell me you're back! You know we live here, right? You can't just show up when you feel like it and put holes in our mind. But only need to get to Pinwheel Circus quickly. Fred has directions, I swear. No fights, no delays. Just the circus. <sighs> Fine. But we're escorting you to make sure you don't break anything. You know, again. Here it is. Here's your port of the pinwheel. Come on, no reason to wait around. Move it! You know the hole in your roof is only technically our fault, right? You know that technically I'm actually okay with Foxy here using people as chew toys? Point taken. Alright, we're going through three sub-levels still, Springtrap. Don't panic. Stay with us and don't panic! I think I'm starting to get used to Pac-Man for your vision. How much worse could it be? You know that question I asked two some levels ago? I remember that question. I remember that question a lot. And now Springles, we're almost there! Well, I could kiss you beautiful on pixel ground! And there's Fender ahead! His business was quick! That was faster than I expected! It wasn't time consuming, but it needed doing. I stopped by again because I just remembered. You might encounter trouble getting to the fun house. Apparently there's a giant pig and a giant bear and animatronic roaming around. If you make up, they should pick on someone their own size joke, Fred, I'm going to put my hope through your knee. I wouldn't dream of it. At any rate, I just wanted to warn you to be careful after your last fight. Oh, and Springtrap, just try to focus on the fun house. You'll find your next clock there. <laughs>